What's up guys, it's me best to what and today I'll show a tutorial on how to bring back the command and space keyboard shortcut for changing the language input sources. So first of all, let's recall a bit. After I did the software upgrade for the computer, I found out that the command and space keyboard shortcut has been assigned for the spotlight search as follows. And this was a very annoying issue because I'm not used to this keyboard shortcut. Previously, I've been using the command and space mainly for changing the language input sources. So to change it back, we will have to go to system preferences and then keyboard and then shortcuts. And let's take a look at the spotlight tab. So as you can see, the show spotlight search command has been assigned as command and space while the input sources have been assigned as the control and space. So now an option that I'll be doing is that I will switch between the two. So let's go to the spotlight first and then we'll select the first row and press enter and then we'll replace it with the default keyboard shortcut for the input sources which is control and space and we'll receive a message that shortcut used by another action don't worry about it it's just that we will we are going to change the input sources keyboard shortcut later on and then we'll do the same thing we'll select the first row and press enter. Now we'll use the command that we're familiar with it, which is the command and space. And there we go, that's basically it. Now let's test whether it works or not. So let's take a look at the language input sources while I'm pressing the command and space. Okay, now it's changed to Thai and then press it again. Has been changed back to English. So thanks for watching guys, if you find this helpful interesting please like comment and subscribe and those will be very much appreciated bye bye see you in the next videos